Okay, so it's 11.45. I motored up uh, over to Martinez Peak here. I took off pretty early. Took off at about 11.26. And, uh... I wanted to get off before it got any hotter on the ground. It was like 106 when I took off at uh, Bermuda Dunes. I shut down at 7,000 feet and I'm just working around on some stuff here. It's a bit early yet. But, oy. there's a good little core here. I just can't quite center it up. I don't know if that's because it's still early in the. Uh, solid lift yet or, or what but anyway we'll just stick with it thought I'd maybe try to go south today but we'll see I don't have any oxygen so I think I'll keep myself uh, no higher than 12.5 if, if I get that high see how I feel All right, well, I'm uh, east of Warner Springs, pretty much over Hot Springs Peak, climbing uh, 11 3, and uh, I'm going to keep moseying south and see how I do. Little cues keep popping uh, up by Thomas Mountain and uh, San Jack. And they dissolve, so I don't know what's going on up there. But I think I'm in the shear line. There's a light east, southeast wind out of the desert. And uh, it's kind of westerly on the west side of the mountains. So I think the shear is happening down the crest here. And this thermal's getting a little better. We're going through, uh, about to go through 12 here. All right, so I'm uh, working a little kind of weak lift because I just don't want to get very low. And uh, I'm just north of Lake Cuyamaca, maybe three, two or three miles. I'm trying to get into this thermal. It feels like it's there. Just can't seem to get it cored up. Now, if I were playing something real high performance, I'd blow past this thing, but... Uh, a 25 or 6 to 1 glider like this, I'm going to work pretty much everything. Okay, so I'm uh, over Mount Laguna, I'm at 9100, and I just got a little bump. I'm trying to kind of sort out where it is, and hopefully it'll do that getting stronger thing that the other thermals have done. They've all started out a little bumpy and kind of weak. We'll see. Anyway, pretty neat. Haven't been down this way in you know, years and years and years. So I guess I'm going to try and turn Hakamba. Uh, we'll see what happens. Kind of notorious sinkhole, but uh, we'll see. Uh, I'm just a couple miles south of Mount Laguna, and uh, I'm more lift here, and uh, again, I can't really seem to core it up very well. I don't know what's going on with that, but maybe I'm just trying to work the, the tops of it, you know, and I keep bumping into what feels like a good little core, and then I just seem to fly right out of it, like that. Anyway, I guess I'm about 15 or 16 miles north of Hakumba, so pretty sure I'll get Hakumba. Don't, don't know if I'll get back, but we'll see. Okay, I'm uh, 10,000 feet. I'm uh, still heading for Hakumba. The GPS says I'm about uh, seven miles north. 
And I'm at 10,000, so I'm sure I'm going to get Hakamba. I can see it out over the nose. I think what I'll do is go over the airport and then turn left and go over the high ground. I got this nagging suspicion that there's a shear line off to the west of me, but I don't have the guts to go for it. Okay, well, five miles north of Hakamba, I'll turn the cam back on when I am at Hakamba. All right, well, I'm... I'm at Hakamba. This feels like there should be a good thermal here. I bumpy and all kinds of sink and lift and rowdiness. Well, I guess we don't want to invade Tijuana. There's the border. We're, we're right at the border. And there's Hakamba right down there. Uh, we're going to head to the hills here. Well, I got low north of uh, Hakamba and decided to go east. Uh, I'm starting to think that was the wrong way to go. And I got really low and started the motor. So, uh, down to 4,000. I'm heading towards this little airport that's out here because I want to go look at it for future reference, as long as I'm down here. Anyway, I got to Hakamba, and I don't know, five or six miles north. Wow, wow, look at that, lift. Where were you a minute ago? I'm letting the motor warm up. Oh, I'm flying along so slow and still coming down. Something you got to think about when you're flying motor gliders, or at least this kind of motor glider. Okay, well, I'm at Mount Laguna. Motor, had to motor glide my way back into the, back up onto the mountains, into the shear. I think my mistake was not Kind of going more westerly on the way into Hakumba and on the way. But, you know, kind of hard to say. So I'm going to see if I can just cruise along up the, uh, up the eastern edge of the mountains here. And, you know, I just may try going, uh, more direct over these ridges rather than up, uh, you know, uh, the main spine of the mountain. I don't know yet. We'll see. I'm uh, way out over the low desert. I'm like east of about halfway between Granite Peak and uh, uh, Akatia Wells. Due south of Borrego, and it's just booming out here. I I uh, was screwing around over the main ridge, and, and I just couldn't get things figured out. So I flew directly towards the coastline until I got over Cuyamaca Peak, which is uh, right off the nose right now. I flew all the way out over that, and it was just smooth. And then I just did a 180 and flew the opposite heading out into the desert until I hit lift. And I hit a little bit at Granite Peak. And then uh, kept going kind of east, and now I'm just going up like crazy out here over the flats. So... I don't know. Uh, I'm trying to learn how the shear line down here works, <laughs> but I'm not very. Uh, yeah, I don't have don't have it figured out. Well, so I got to thirteen thousand feet back over uh, near Acatillo or whatever that is back there, and then I've just been gliding ever since, and uh, I'm only about. 
seven or eight miles from Bermuda Dunes. It's right in front of us here. I never did figure out <laughs> what was going on with all that shear lines and stuff uh, south of Warner. But it was booming out over the low desert. Jacqueline, Cochrane, Bermuda Dunes, Warner. Automated weather observation 2250 Zulu. Wind 140 at 08. Peak gusts 16. Visibility 10. Sky condition clear. Temperature 43 Celsius. Dew point minus 02 Celsius. Altimeter 2970. Remarks. Density altitude 3003. Well, I think I will uh, bump start the motor here. So, fuel selector is where I want it. Bottle's idle. Fuel flap's already shut. I want masters, mags, fuel pump. The so master, mags, fuel pump. And uh, we'll go with some choke, I guess. And we'll speed up and unfeather. And Bermuda Dunes traffic motor glider. Eight for Quebec, uh, final for one zero. Full stop. Bermuda Dunes.